Today we're going to discuss when the limit does not exist. The limit does exist when the, on the graph, from the left and the right, they approach the same y value. Here's when the limit may not exist, when you are approaching different values from the left and the right. Here's an example. As we approach x, so approach 2 on the x-axis, from the left and the right, if we approach from the left, Two and let's see, we're ending up here at four. And from the right, if we have a graph that looks like this, we're approaching, let's say, x y equals one. This would be a case where the limit does not exist because there's a gap in the graph; it is not continuous. The limit may also not exist if we have unbounded behavior. So here we're saying is we have x approaches four. What's happening on the graph? So, four. so if we have a graph from the left, we're coming up here at 4, and from the right, we're coming up this way. So here's our x equals 4. If we look up here, it's unbounded. This is what we call unbounded behavior because the graph just keeps going up and up forever. It's approaching infinity. And the last case is oscillating behavior. A graph like this would be where the values are just bouncing back and forth. So it looks something like this. The limit would also not exist in that case.